Okay, so we got the stuff in, it came in. I think this is the leather, I think this is the kit. Um, it's been about a hundred bucks, not too bad. Um, but about the template, I think I'm actually, same concept, but flip it sideways, if that makes sense. I think that's what I'm gonna do. I'll show you the new template, but this is definitely a, a still good template. Um, but I just think the other way would be cool, uh, something new. Um, but yeah, let's, so let's open this up. Okay, so we got the leather now. Let's just open this up here. Okay, so if you noticed, there was no um, um, stitching groover. So that's what this is, this is a Tandy. Uh, actually, the one nice thing that I got, besides the leather, um, this is one millimeter-ish. Um, not quite sure what ounce, but one millimeter should tell you that also if you know leather. Um, I didn't get a lot. I got just a, just a little bit because I didn't know what size I really wanted because I want to make wallets, but I also want to make knife sheaths, right? All right, guys, so now I've gotten them printed out, the template, the new template, um, and I'll sh give you a brief overview on that. Um, here, I just printed out another copy of it. Um, but yeah, let me just show y'all what it is. So there's the bottom. Um, let's see. There's the middle. There's the top, and then the back, and then a money holder. Um, so it goes like this. Very back, middle, I guess you could say, then that, then that, then this, to create something that looks kind of like that. Um, but yeah. So let's get into it. All right, so we can start tracing these onto the leather. We're gonna use our awl and just stretch a line. There's that. Now we're gonna take this one. 
I'll do the same thing. Okay, we're going to want to take our stitching irons or punches, that's what you call them, um, and we're going to start in the hole. We're going to start the first one right there. We'll actually use the big one. We'll use the big one right here. So we got them punched in and now we just got to align them and sew it up. So let's do that. Okay, so I'm not quite sure where I left off, but because my camera died, sorry about that, but we just stitched it up right there and then we stitched it up right here. Um, I showed you all how I stitched that a little bit, I think, but if I didn't, I'll just show you all again. Um, but there's a few layers, and now here's the, the top sheet that will go up here. And so I'm just gonna um, punch that out. Okay, so we got all the holes punched in all of them. Um, now we just gotta uh, thread it. Um, I've already started. I just gotta punch through with that all, like, a lot. Because it's just so much mass I gotta go through but uh I'll I'll time lapse this for y'all and and I'll show y'all and I'll show it to y'all when I'm finished
Okay, so this is how it turned out. This is the end result after I had stitched it all up and um, put the cards in it. It's a little bit um, tighter than I would have liked, um, so it needs to stretch a lot. Um, but, you know, it only stretches so much. But the money in the back fits very it fits perfectly sorry it fits perfectly the cards there's two in this front pocket one in this uh, middle and then driver's license right there um i like it like i can't tell you how much i like it i think this turned this turned out way better than i thought it would have um stitching not the straightest um but right here uh this this row i really got the hang of it um this row was okay but just going through all these layers um, I don't think I'm gonna just do. I'm, I don't think I'm gonna do all these layers next time. Um, but yeah, overall, very pleased. So cool. If y'all would please like and subscribe, and I'll see y'all next time. Peace.